All right, so we are continuing our Furious Charge Breaking the Siege series, uh, this time with the versus SDR stage. And for anybody that missed the last video, just a quick reminder, the weakness for this event is the Pure Saiyans category, so you want to make sure that your attackers are Pure Saiyans units. And there are five waves of enemies per stage with five enemies per wave. And the amount of turns you get to uh, beat each wave gets fewer and fewer with every successive wave. So for waves one and two, you get three turns. For waves three and four, you get two turns. And then for wave five, you only get one turn. Now, our team this time is kinda similar to the last one, except our attackers, our main attackers, are of course AGL Pure Saiyans units, the LR Nappa and Vegeta. I also have the LR Majin Vegeta. And the rest of the team is not actually all supports because I found an issue with the Nappa and Vegeta. And that was, if you bring too many support units, they actually get their uh, 18 key super too easily. And their 18 key super does not attack all, it only attacks one enemy, which means that you might have some trouble clearing the waves if you get that 18 key super too much. So instead of bringing all supports, I brought the double LRs, I brought my Majin Vegeta, I brought LR Broly, even though he's not going to be hitting as hard, he should still do some damage. And also the Int Broly, one support in the Topo, and also the AGL Wrathful Broly. So that's the team, and for items, we are once again bringing the Bulma for the uh, attack support, and a nuking item, which is the Chi Lai. Now obviously, like I said, you don't have to really bring, you know, a specific type. Uh, you can do, you know, the Deborah Cookie or the Lemo or whatever you want. I just like to match the type of item with the type of attacker. So, uh, with all that said, let's jump right into it. Second stage here versus SDR uh, should be pretty simple. Now, I haven't actually beat all five phases yet because during my stream, I was really stupid and I wasn't keeping track of the phases, so I actually spammed all my items uh, on the second last phase. So by the time we got to wave five, I was out of items, I couldn't do enough damage, and that's why I lost. So today we should be able to clear it for the first time, barring any stupid mistakes from me. All right, so yeah, first wave pretty easy, lots of damage looking pretty good and now we're on the second wave and we also have our you know what? I'm kind of curious to see how much damage the um, LR Broly actually does uh, there's actually no way to get a super with him though so I guess we're not doing that but at some point I would like to see because I know that the enemies do get damage reduction against any uh, attacker that's not like the advantageous type but how much of a damage reduction are we talking here you know is it like 10% or 50% or like 90% because in that case Broly would be doing like no damage but I'm just kind of curious to see you know all right so this is phase three we're still good here uh, let's give two key that's still an 18 key super perfect rather 12 key super still a 12 key super and we also got an 18 key super with Vegeta. So just in case we don't finish them off with Nappa, Vegeta will definitely finish the job. But I think we're okay here too. Yeah, 7.2, 7.2, Oh! Interesting. Okay, so I did not think that it would not be enough. Okay, good to know. So. Uh, what I'm going to do is pop the Bulma here, right? And then, uh, oh, there's no way for Topo to actually super, I guess. So let's just throw Topo over there. Um, I'll give one orb to them. And then we'll give a super to Broly as well. It's going to be an interesting test to see like how much Broly can actually hit for. Is it going to be like a couple hundred thousand, or is it going to be like a couple thousand? Alright. So, yeah, it's not enough to actually kill everybody on waves 3 and 4 with uh, 
Just Nappa and Vegeta's one super. If we got an additional, could have still done it. Wow, look at that. Okay, so Broly's not actually hitting that hard. I mean, I think he's going to be hitting hard enough to still clear the, the phase, but it's kind of close. Yeah, it's kind of close. Damn, all right. Is that enough? Okay, okay, we're good. We're good. All right, I, I got a little bit worried there. I'm not going to lie. I got a little bit worried, but now we can pop the chi -lies. Get uh, some nice damage for our Majin Vegeta, and if he doesn't solo them, oh my god, okay, yeah, he is going to solo them. <laughs> Majin Vegeta is going to get the job done. And then if he doesn't do it, then obviously uh, Nappa will definitely close the show, so we got this, guys. I didn't screw up this time. We're good to go. There we go. Yeah, we got this. We got this. All right, so as I said, you know, these videos are not really supposed to be guide videos. They're more so just to give you guys an idea of how I did it. And uh, if it does happen to give you some ideas or give you some inspiration for what you can do with your box, with your teams, then, uh, you know, that'd be awesome. I'd be very happy about that. But, you know, the intention is not really to, like, go super in-depth with the explanations. So hopefully, you know, these videos help a little bit. But there you go, man. Two done. Three to go. Uh, probably one more video coming tonight in a few hours, and then I'm gonna run to the gym. But uh, I kind of enjoy this event. Not gonna lie, like it's it's very quick. It's it's very basic. Um, as I said in the last video, though, I'm not a huge fan of the fact that like it's a probably limited time event that a lot of newer players aren't able to actually beat. But I just want to clarify, like I don't mind events that are permanently there. That you know. Uh, take some time for newer players to work towards but this one seems like one of those events that will be gone you know once uh, the celebrations over and maybe I'm wrong maybe it's gonna be here permanently who knows but if it is a time limited event and newer players are gonna struggle with it I just think it's kind of uncool you know because they'll like probably never get a chance to actually get all the rewards but we'll see We'll see, right now I'm just speculating. Either way, that is versus SDR. That is Nappa and Vegeta dominating. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.